What's up, Father Muckers? My name is Big Head. I like to ride scooters really fast. Probably gonna die on that thing. I'm not gonna lie. It's kind of new. This company sent me it, and I was like actually stoked about this thing. But I kind of got hit by a car, like three or four or five or... I mean, it still works, except for it has a flat tire. So we're gonna take it somewhere and we're gonna get that flat tire fixed. My front wheel is completely flat. So we're on the way right now to a bike shop or a uh, lawnmower shop and hopefully they can fix that. Dude, I'm surprised I can go 40 miles an hour on a flat tire. Watch this, 33 miles an hour, no hands. At the first intersection, I'm gonna show you guys what it's like to like actually go on a street. Right, we're cooking, 37. Everyone looks at me the whole time. I don't know why. They just think I'm weird for it, but I like riding scooters, you know? Like, it's just my thing. <laughs> Come on, Andy. I believe in you. I know that you could fix my scooter. Um, Me and my dad fixed my scooter. I love you. Thank you for your help. I appreciate it. We got the whole front wheel fixed. We put in a valve stem that I got from AutoZone and it somehow fits in my scooter. So, Varla, can you please respond to your emails? Because I've been emailing you about this thing for the last week. What's up, people? It's day two. I got a new package today. I'm really freaking excited about this package because this package is gonna let me charge my scooter in three hours. And I'm pretty sure you're not supposed to do this like at all, but I really don't care because at this point, why would I care? Here's the package. Basically what this means is that I can make full-time content on my scooter. So like, I am so excited about this thing. Obviously yesterday I fixed the front wheel on my scooter, but I still have to get the brakes on my scooter fixed because my brakes literally don't work at all. You need to bring your bike in for service. Hello, this is true. Hey, I have a scooter. I was wondering if I brought it in. Could you fix the brakes on it? Yeah. Okay, perfect. Let's ride there. <laughs> All right, we're 2.4 miles away. Dude, I really need to get gloves because it's literally like 66 degrees out and it's supposed to rain. Like, what the frick? Oh, so my phone doesn't fall out. Wait, wait. No. Oh no. Let's see if I can get my phone before it gets run over. Uh, you are literally. Oh my gosh. I literally. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you so freaking much. Thank you so much. I appreciate you so much. I will. Holy crap, my phone's not broken. Thank you. <laughs> Are they working? Yeah. Let's go. All right. How you doing, bud? Oh, sorry, I didn't even mean to record you. How you doing? No, you're good. I don't feel good. <laughs> I like the thing, that's pretty cool. Thank you, I appreciate it. Um, So we got the new charger. I'm gonna plug her in. Ah, uh, just right there. Ah! Uh. There we go. Shout out to Fuel Mart, dude. Honestly, what a great guy right there. Freaking love you, bro. Okay, so I'm not gonna lie, like the whole reason I was gonna film this video in the first place was to do a Varla Eagle One Pro scooter review. And obviously we haven't done that yet. Starting up front right here, we've got this beautiful display. First mode is zero to 12. The second mode is like zero to 28. And the third mode is zero to 45. Over here, we've got the lights. And these lights are like actually bright as absolute Dude, like look how bright these lights are. Moving down the scooter, we have a thousand watt motors. There's actually flashing brake lights on it. I've even gotten hit by a car on this thing and somehow it's still holding together. It still works perfectly fine. Varla, you guys did great on this scooter. To put the scooter like slightly more into perspective this literally is like a Suron and a scooter unfortunately it's like way harder to wheelie so like I can't do that yet but the scooter all in all is a freaking beast and for $2,100 like this thing is totally worth that much $2,100 60 volt battery 1,000 watts 1,000 watts this thing's a freaking beast I wanted to show you guys how freaking good this scooter is. And I haven't got to show you that because the whole beginning of this video was me fixing this scooter. So what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna go on like a kind of busy road and I'm gonna race some cars and just show you. Like this thing is a freaking tank. Main road time. Let's catch up with this car. <laughs> Holy crap, this scooter. 
curious about uh, 34. Cutting up on the electric scooter. Oh! <laughs> Cutting up on the electric scooter. Oops, oops, oops. Switching lanes. Oops, switching lanes again. Oh, you already know. If I don't get pulled over like riding like this, I will genuinely be so surprised. <laughs> the cops still aren't after me, so we're good. Not too worried. Oh, all right, let's get out before those cars. Just look at this thing. Like, oh my gosh. We need yeah. more of these. Right on. Right on. Yeah. 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 You want to race? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Let's do it. <laughs> I think I'm winning. I'm winning. I'm winning. <laughs> yeah. What? Yeah. Oh, you are? Yeah. There you go. Nice meeting you. So All right, let's go. Oh, holy crap. The wind just blew the absolute frick out of me. That was terrifying. I think you guys have seen the abilities of the scooter. So all that being said, thank you so much for watching this video. The Varla Eagle One is honestly a great scooter. And if you want more content like this, in the next video, I'm gonna be reviewing the two Swift board. But until then, I'll see you guys then. Ain't trying to see her on these house for the next few days. She like me cause I'm